represent over 125 families across Western New York. Yeah. That's some serious, awesome work. So On day one of the passage and implementation of the Marijuana Tax and Regulation Act, the community has to be engaged day one. The underground market has to be engaged day one. If that does not happen, then we've actually failed. And I'm not in a failing business. The founders of this country built it on the fact that the purpose of government is taking care of the people. So if the purpose is taking care of the people, and you keep locking up people for no reason, basically, then who's taking care of their families? Of the Hood Incubator, we're a national organization that's really working to use this cannabis legalization moment as an opportunity to build power for black communities that have been negatively impacted and devastated by the drug war. Some of your legislators don't think that items like expungement and direct resources into our community is a priority. One thing, I'm tired of having budget ballots on my back in the back of my people. The people of Buffalo, the people of Rochester, the people of Syracuse and Albany, the people of New York, they have had enough. is not an option. People get arrested for marijuana possession when it's snowing, when it's hailing, when it's raining, when it's cold, or when it's 100 degrees, right? So we have to have that same kind of energy when it comes to demanding justice for our people and for our community, right? Yeah. It's muddy out here, it's disgusting. I know y'all shoes is getting towed up. Guess what? Assembly Majority Leader is here in her coach flats, standing in the same mud right along with us, amen? amen. The underground industry is $2 billion. That's a conservative estimate. $2 billion. So there's an opportunity for us to begin to, you know, reinvest in communities that have been impacted by the mass incarceration. Thank you to all of our sponsors and partners for the Hood Incubator, Pharmacy 6, Flora Buffalo, I'm Open Buffalo. God bless the food. God bless the rain that's nourishing the ground in our bellies. Amen. Amen. Amen.